The broadcast is now starting. All attendees are in listen-only mode. Welcome to It's Your Call, Successful Phone and Video Interviewing. I'm Sophia Dixon, and today we're going to address the following. Together we will go through the phone interview, the video call interview, setting up your interview space, getting familiar with your technology, common interview questions, questions you should ask, storytelling and the CARS method, and some improv and practice activities. As we start with the phone interview, you want to keep in mind similar preparations as a regular interview. You want to have your resume and questions about the job or company on hand and write bullet point answers to potential questions as opposed to reading off entire sentences. You also want to be sure to take notes during the interview if there's anything you want to address at the end of the interview or ask any more questions you come up with. Be aware of any time zone differences as well so you don't miss your scheduled call time. The location is also important. You want to have your call someplace quiet, comfortable, and distraction-free. You also want to show preparedness by answering your phone call early. You greet the, interview polite, the interviewer politely and express your appreciation and consideration for their time. You also want to remember that you have all the answers to their interview questions. You will appeal to them by being your authentic and original self. Remember to relax. You also want to dress as you would for a regular face-to-face -face interview in the video interview. If you haven't done this before, just remember to dress nicer than you would for daily for the position. You can keep notes to prepare for the interview, but be sure to keep them out of camera view. It is also helpful to know how to work your device before your interview time. We'll discuss this more later in the presentation. In a video interview, the location is also important. It is best to be seated at a table with a plain background to keep the attention on you. You also want to test your camera so that you know what your interviewer will be able to see during your interview. Appearing calm, relaxed, and prepared will impress the interviewer and result in a more relaxed interview experience over a video call. It will be easier to display your sincerity and personality on the screen in this manner as well. Be sure to use body language to simulate your interest. Sit up straight and keep your shoulders back while you talk. Next, we'll discuss setting up your space for the interview. You would like to organize and set up your table in a space that has room for your computer, resume, and any notes you may need. Ensure your backdrop is plain and not distracting. Make sure your face will be illuminated properly, perhaps with a table or floor lamp nearby. You would also like to avoid dramatic shadows on your face and avoid appearing shiny. To avoid this, it is possible you may want to give your face a quick powder with some makeup. Choose a quiet, private location so there are no interruptions and be sure to turn off any phone ringers or alarms. You also want to be sure to get familiar with your device before the interview time. Play around with your webcam and microphone in advance. Make sure they work and that the camera is at eye level. Speak to the camera and not to your screen if you can help it. It is a good idea to make a practice call with a family friend or a friend. Evaluate your ability to use the technology during this conversation with them and figure out what your interviewer will be able to see during the call. It is also noteworthy to mention that different video call methods, such as FaceTime and Skype, might see more or less of your background in the frame, so be sure to Experiment with the service you will be using for the interview. For example, Skype requires a professional username. You want to make test calls with your friends and family and explore their specific calling features. Also, if you accidentally click something during your interview, if you have experience with it, it will be less of an issue if you already know how to fix it. It is also advisable to test everything again an hour or so before your interview to ensure the camera and microphone still work and there are no um, interruptions. <laughs> know whether you are supposed to call them or vice versa. If you're supposed to call them on Skype, be sure to ask for their, inter their username ahead of time and add them to your contacts. Don't panic. 
Technology tends to fail when you need it the most. Remain polite and positive. If something goes wrong, suggest hanging up and trying the video call again. Before you do this, make sure you have their contact information so you can get right back in touch with them. It is also a good idea to close other computer applications before your interview to avoid being distracted by pop-ups during your video call or talk. We have also included a handout for some, for some common interview questions you can use to prepare for your interview. These include what are your strengths, weaknesses, interests, and projections for the future. It is also important to have some questions handy to ask the interview at the, to ask the interviewer at the end of your interview. You want to avoid asking yes or no questions and ask things like what your day-to-day -day responsibilities with, for the job will look like and what the culture of the company you would be working for is like. Take this time to work through this improv practice activity. To do this, you can take any object, such as a belt or a pen or a piece of paper, and use it creatively. The only rule is that you use it in a way other than the original way it was intended. This helps you start thinking creatively on your feet and can be a useful skill for interviewing effectively and confidently. The power of storytelling in an interview. A great story comes from using what you know capturing a truth from experiencing it and from expressing values you feel deeply. Allow the listener to make their own deductions about you from the story. In other words, don't come out and say that you're collaborative, adaptable, or anything like that. Tell a story that convinces your listener that you possess these traits. To use the CARS method to tell your story, you want to focus on the circumstance or the challenge and your actions and the results that came about from that. This helps clearly demonstrate your value and helps the interviewer recognize and connect with your successes. For example, a recruiter may say, tell me about a challenge you faced in your last position. Your response would include the challenge, the action, and the result. At this time, you can Take a minute and work on our second improv practice activity. This also helps with thinking on your feet and coming up with new creative ideas. Next, we'll discuss more specifics about doing a practice phone or video interview with a friend or family member. Establish what position and company you are pretending to be applying for have a friend assume the role of the recruiter. Ask them to call you for a phone screening. Answer the five questions. Tell me about yourself. What was the biggest challenge you faced in your last position? What is your greatest strength and weakness? Why are you a good fit for this position? And what questions do you have for me? Ask your friend to rate your answers, your presentation, and offer constructive feedback based on what we've discussed in this presentation. Lastly, before the interview, here are some exercises to help you loosen up. To physically loosen your body, you can hold out your arm and shake it, counting to eight. Then repeat the shaking count for your left hand, right foot, and left foot. Repeat this entire process, each time counting up to decreasing numbers of seven, six, five, four, and so on, until you finally shake each limb once. This allows you to loosen up in time for the interview and allow you to relax. For more information on the CDC's programs and services, visit us on the web at cdcchicago.org.